The KDE project has just rolled out KDE Plasma 6.2.5, the fifth and final update in the KDE Plasma 6.2 desktop environment series. This release focuses exclusively on bug fixes and enhancements, ensuring a more stable and polished experience for users. Key improvements and fixes. Coming just over a month after KDE Plasma 6.2.4, the 6.2.5 release addresses several critical bugs. Let's start with some of the standout fixes. System settings, crash fix. A persistent crash issue in the system settings app was resolved. This bug previously caused the app to crash when a mouse was plugged in while viewing the mouse page. Lock screen bug. A significant issue was resolved where the lock screen would display an entirely black screen during X11 sessions. This bug was particularly frustrating for users relying on secure and seamless session locks. Power Devil Stability One of the most commonly reported crashes in Power Devil has been fixed, improving the reliability of power management on the Plasma desktop. KWIN Window Manager fixes a notable crash in the KWIN window, and Composite Manager was addressed. This crash occurred after running out of file descriptors when using certain non-Intel GPU drivers. Crunner Search Field Improvement A visual issue in Crunner Search Field caused typed text to overlap with placeholder text. This has now been resolved, making the search field more functional and user-friendly. Notification positioning bug notifications being mispositioned after dragging desktop widgets for the first time was a common issue. The root cause was traced to old system tray widgets in the Plasma config file. With this fix, not only has the notification positioning been corrected, but memory usage has been reduced, and other potential issues stemming from these outdated widgets have also been eliminated. Additional fixes and enhancements. KDE Plasma 6.2.5 also includes a series of refinements aimed at enhancing usability and performance. Screen Lock Pointer Fix Resolved a bug causing a black screen when the pointer was wiggled as the screen was about to lock. Plasma Discover Improvements A visual bug in Plasma Discover caused UI elements to overlap on expanded list items in the updates page. This issue has been fixed, ensuring a smoother package management experience. Application Menu Positioning Fixed a problem with the application menu appearing in the wrong position when accessed via the window title bar while using Qt 6.8. WireGuard VPN Enhancements The persistent Keep Alive setting in WireGuard VPN has been fixed, ensuring better stability and functionality for VPN users. Screen Recording Improvements Spectacle and OBS Studio Now handle screen scaling better when recording specific windows, delivering more accurate results. Bing Wallpapers Metadata Improved handling of metadata for Bing Picture of the day wallpapers Enhancing the overall visual experience Enhanced image handling Improved the ability to paste images from Plasma notifications into sandboxed applications Input Capture portal support Improved support for applications that use the input capture portal allowing users to regain full control of their keyboard and pointer more quickly Performance Enhancements, Plasma System, Monitor Optimization. The CPU usage of the Plasma System Monitor app has been significantly reduced, particularly before visiting the history page. KDIWIN HDR Metadata. Handling KDIWIN has been made more robust against apps that send faulty HDR metadata, preventing crashes and improving overall stability. Plasma Widget Reliability. Plasma is now more resilient against faulty widgets, reducing the likelihood of crashes caused by widget-related issues. Updating to KDE Plasma 6.2.5 The full change log for KDE Plasma 6.2.5 is available for those interested in the complete list of fixes and improvements. Users are encouraged to keep an eye on their software repositories for the latest KDE Plasma 6.2.5 packages. Updating to this version will ensure a more stable and reliable desktop experience, packed with bug fixes and performance enhancements. This release is a testament to the KDE project's commitment to continuous improvement, offering users a polished and dependable desktop environment. Make sure to update your system to enjoy these benefits.